welcome back to another asphalt day video guys and i am your host rahul and we are playing the host 918 spider enduro double down challenge and in this challenge we have to get like 75000 endurance points in order to unlock this host 918 spider but i know there's only like 7 days and 11 hours left for this challenge to end so Let's do our best to, to collect as many endurance points as possible. Okay then, let's move on to challenge 1. In this challenge, all we have to do is achieve the goal which is assigned to us. I selected this one because it seemed easy. I just had to get in the top 3 in this challenge in order to get those points yeah. and one more thing in this challenge you cannot save your points until you beat a nice racer after you beat a nice racer you can either risk your points or save them saving them means you don't lose them when you lose after beating the ace racer and they when you when you risk, uh, risk the points, uh, you cannot save them until you beat the another ace racer. But the reward is that you get double the points as you get in a single race. So let's get on with this race. I actually max this car in order to increase my chances of winning this challenge. Um, when I go further and further into this challenge, the races get harder and harder. I'm familiar with this track, so I won't have any problem with this. Let's see whether the other guys can catch him. Yes, we will be, we'll be doing good in this challenge. Yeah, we already lost them. There's no sign of them taking us now. We are lifting this map very slow. No items to go ahead and increase my pace. Uh, the interesting thing about this challenge is that you can unlock the, uh, every single kind of port car which they unleashed now in this game. There is uh, 5 port cars totally. You can get them all if you get 75,000 points all at once. I missed a few cars like a uh, Porsche uh, GT4. I don't know what the uh, full form is now, but. I missed that car and another car, Bosch 911 GT, uh, yeah, GT3 RS I think. Actually uh, in that R&D I made it to like test 47 and then I couldn't, uh, I ran out of time. So that was disastrous. Hope, hopefully we can unlock that car in this Enduro Double Down Challenge. Um, Let's move on to the second race. This is gonna be a long video guys, so stay tuned. Um, yeah, if you like my videos, uh, make sure you subscribe to my channel. Also, uh, click that bell like icon and select get notified for all notifications. So that you can get notified whenever I upload a video. Uh, I don't know, uh, um, I also upload videos of other games like uh, what is it? Yeah, Clash Royale and Clash of Clans. Uh, sometimes I upload that, and yeah, sometimes even Pokemon Go. And Pokemon Go in my country, uh, there's not much to do, so I might not even make Pokemon Go videos as they might not be even interesting to watch. So I'll just stick to Clash of Clans and Clash Royale. Other than asphalt, 
Oh, let me see what are what is the goal I need to finish. So oh, I just need to finish this race. Yeah, I'm familiar with this track, so it won't be hard. <laughs> Even though all I need to do is finish this race. Yeah. It will be even okay if I just make it to the seventh position. I we do not need to make to the first position, first place. I think we just end up in the first place. These guys are not a challenge for us because I just maxed out this car during the push nine, uh, yeah, nine by nine challenge. I mean championship. I unlocked two of the postcards until now. Oh no! Shit. I just drifted out of the track. Anyway. Here in a good place. So yeah, we won't have any problem. In this game, the stunts are so unrealistic, uh, like that. But it's such a fun game to play. Anyway. I generally like the multiplayer in this game. It's quite challenging going against other players who are good at this game. Yeah, I need to activate the double credit booster in order to get as many go uh, credits as possible. So that I can upgrade these challenge cars elimination. Both are both seem so easy. So I'll select this or the RS3 sports pack. Oops. I just load it up. Yep, I activated the double credits now. Now we'll be getting double the credits. This might end even sooner than the last race because it's selling motion. There's a timer ticking down. When the timer reaches zero, the last one stand, uh, the last person in the pack will be eliminated. That's how this challenge, in this race works. So we might not be even the last person. I think. Yeah, our acceleration seems pretty low, but our top speed is uh, very high. Than, uh, very high. What is it? Yeah, our top speed is greater than these guys, I think. Yeah, it definitely is. I think this guy will pass us from so let's just knock him out and move on with this way. It's a good thing I I drove several races along this track, so it's like a what is it? Yeah. These tracks are like a I know these tracks like the back of my hand. Uh, this is the Iceland track. This track only has the what do you see? This track has the deepest shortcuts. If you miss them, you just lose the race miserably. So let's not miss them. See? Let's take this round. Yes. Full throttle ahead to the finish line. Oh, there's no finish line in this race since it's an elimination round. So there's four more seconds. Three, two, one. Yeah, yeah, we won. So we got 80 and 0 points. Yeah, see, we got double the credits now. Now we are going against the race winner. Yep, 
affects during this time so that we can maximize our chances of winning this. Okay, let's upgrade the top speed. So we got 216 now. Should we upgrade the acceleration or nitrous? I think we will upgrade both of them. I have enough for the situation upgrade. Now I am low on credit. Doesn't matter, I can form the uh, Lamborghini when I know. Challenge 15. In the in that race I'll get like I'll get around 12,000 credits each race. And that too within 56 seconds. Yeah, that's pretty good. Uh, approximately in an hour, I can form around 300. Ah, uh, yeah, 300,000 credits in an hour. I can make more or less. Yeah, this is the Nevada track. It's not miss this or not. If we crash even once, we lose this one, and by losing, we lose everything. Like the points we collected until now. So let's get this right. So I didn't get that barrel roll. We could have gotten. Oh no, that was unnecessary. We just missed up the jump. See, he got ahead of us. Let's let's not give him a chance of beating me. Dropping ahead. Yeah, let's hit this ramp. Yeah, we got that. We got the barrel room right. Four meters ahead. Now we need to get this curve right. Let's not crash into anything. Oh, dude. That was scary. Yeah, we won. So now we need to defer. Yeah, there's a three second gap. So we got 130 million points. We got 4,000 points. We now decide whether to save our points or risk our points. I think it's better to risk our points because we are already not uh, doing well on getting the endurance points. With this, we can get like 980 points in the next phase race. So, I can get, get 980 to risk my points. So, that's all for this video, guys. And I hope to see you all in my next video. Until then, see you. Bye bye, guys. Take care. Peace.